ओम शुक्ला ब्रह्म विचार सार परमा महाज्याम जगद्व्यापिनी वीणा पुस्तकधारिणी महेदा जाढ्यांधकारापह हस्ते स्फाटिक मालिकां विदधतीं पद्मासने समस्तितां वंदेतां परमेश्वरीं भगवतीं विद्धिप्रदां शारदां नत्वा सरस्वतीं देवीं शुक्तां गुम्याम करूं पाणिनी अप्रवेशाय कुसिद्धांत कौमुदी So we are looking at Saki Shabda, uh, not Saki Shabda, sorry, Hari Shabda, where Harim Hari Harim, we saw Hari Hi, Hari Haraiha, Harim Hari Harim, and Sambodhan also we saw. Now Shesho Jasaki, here we saw uh, the Ghi Sanya. Saki Shabda Varjitam, except for Saki Shabda, the Ikara or Ukaranta, Ikaranta, Ukaranta Shabda. Which is Hraswa, basically Hraswa, Yau, Idito. So, you, you, Sriyakyo Nadi, that you was Dirgha, you, which included E and U. Now, by saying Hraswa, the Ikara and Ukara have been made it and U. So, Idanta and Udanta. Ikaranta, Ukaranta, except for Sakhi Shabda, which is Ikaranta. Every other Ikaranta and Ukaranta will be Shesha, which is left after the sequence of sutras in the 1-4 uh, earlier section where that Nadi and then Ghi Sanya. So whatever has not got Nadi Sanya, that will get this Ghi Sanya, whatever is remaining. So Shesha it is Pashtartam Raso Yau It Utau Tadantam Saki Varjam Ghi Sanyam Syat. And Ghi Sanya, what is the use? We will see further. So, uh, second case is derived. In the third case, Hari plus Ta. So, we are here, Ango Nastriyam. And Anga, uh, Ang, Ang is a Ta Sanya. He said, Ang iti Ta Sanya. So, Ang, Ango Nastriyam. Na Astriyam. Angaha. Angaha. Na Sorry, not na, astriyam. Sorry, sorry. Anga na adesha bhavati astriyam. Na astriyam. Na is first case adesha. And anga is shashti anga. Ang means ta. For ta, there is na as adesha when astriyam. Not in stri. And what else is the anurutti? If you go to 73120. 73 73 120 <coughs> Ango Nastriyam. Uh, the so for G. Astriyam means what? If you have Mati plus Ta, Mati is Trilinga, it is Ikaranta, Raswa, Ikaranta, but uh, that also gets uh, here you see Ghe, he, only Ghe Parasya Angaha uh, Na Bhavati Astriyam. Just check the Kashika Vritti. Just wanted to cross check something. Seven, three. Uh, I don't know what is the sutra number in Kashika. Okay, I'll come back to it. Let me. Okay, so uh, what is the anurutti? Ghi. Ghe he. So ghe he. Ghe he. Angasya. Angasya. Can bring angasya here. 
सुघेंगस्य परस्य सुघे परस्य अंग अंग नॉट अंगस्य सॉरी घे परस्य घे परस्य सो वी कैन से अंगस्य बट हियर अंग अंग इज व्हाट टा सो अंगस्य वी कैन कीप इट बट व्हाट इज इन द अनुरूति रे परस्य अंग दिस अंग व्हिच इज टा टा संज्ञा अंग इज टा संज्ञा दैट टा विल गेट द ना आदेश टा व्हिच वाज कॉल्ड एज अंग बिफोर पाणिनी महर्षि दैट अंग विल गेट ना त्यात अस्त्रियम व्हेन दिस झे बट अस्त्रियम मति आल्सो because it is hrasvanta here si hraso yau it putau this nadi uh, nadi lakshmi all these words have got nadi sanya whatever remains there in this in the sequence that has got uh, and which is hraswa hraswa that gets ghi sanya but this ghe he even if it is has a ghi sanya but if it is three then it will not be uh, the ta will not be replaced by na so in mati mati you don't see matina you see matya but in pullinga astring astriya means in pullinga and in uh, in uh, uh, in napunsaka so in pullinga and napunsaka astriyam ang or ta will be replaced by na so ghe parasya ghe he angasya parasya so ghe he parasya आंग नाद अस्त्रिया सप्तमी एक वचन सो घे पर यू कैन से दिस हेज टू बी यू कैन टेक इट एज पंचमी परस्य परस्य अंगस्य आई ड्रॉप अंगस्य वी आर नॉट यूजिंग इट सो आई ड्रॉप इट एनी वे सो घे आंग नाद अस्त्रिया आंग इज ए टा संज्ञा एंड देर बाय वॉट विल हेपन हरी प्लस ना hari plus ta which is ang will get na adesha and then hari na will become will take natvam by which sutra adesha pratyeho adesha pratyayoho so this uh, na, na nakara no not adesha pratyam sorry this is today not well i'll be making mistakes so harina so uh, this is by which sutra rashabhyam nuna samana pade but then after that atkup vangnum yavayapi so atkup i was confusing with shatvam so atkup अटकुप वांगनुम व्यवायेपी व्यवायेपी व्हाट हैपेंस रशाभ्याम ह्याम नो नकार से नो हो नहा नो नहा नकार इस आदेश है नहा समान पदे इन द सेम पदा हरिनाइज वन पदा सुप्तिंग अंतम पदम and nakara is part of that therefore you will get samana pade harina natvam then <coughs> i'm sorry <coughs> so harina harina haribhyam so harina haribhyam haribhya before doing this he does haraye ekara hi ne so hari plus ne he derives so we'll go there haribhyam haribhya he just mention it because you don't need additional sutras here he has already covered hari haribhyam hari bhi so here you don't need any any additional sutras here what is happening hari plus bhyam just varna melanam so one thing you have to note here is that sanya that hari gets this hari in when followed by bhyam what is the sanya स्वादिषु असुरनाम स्थानु पदम यचिभम बट दिस इज नॉट यकारादि और अजादि देर फोर भ्याम भ्याम स्थान इन भ्याम स्थान असुरनाम स्थान हरी विल गेट पद संज्ञा सो इफ देर इज एनी पद संधि टू डू देन यू विल डू इट हियर हवेर इकारा 
being an ach and bhakara here uh, with uh, the the vowel and uh, vowel and uh, consonant cannot have a sandhi therefore it is just varna melanam here however here also varna melanam same pada sanya for hari bhi but this sakara becomes visarga by sasojushoruhu and then kharavasanayor visarjaniya so hari bhyam hari bhi he he just gives a walk through because there is nothing else to do here harina then haraye haraye what does he do he says ghair niti so he introduces sutra ghair niti now ne hari plus ne is what hari plus ne hari plus ne is hari plus a hari plus a by which sutra will this nyakara go nyakara is part of what kakagagnya so lashakwa lashaku ka kavarga lashakwa tadhite atadhite this is not a tadhita pratya it is a sup pratya so lashakwa tadhite will mark it as it and then tasya lopah thereby this nye pratya is what it is a nit pratya nyakaraha it yasmin pratye sa pratye ha nit pratya and nit nit saptami of nit will be niti niti pare ghe he this whatever has got ghi sanya ghe he niti pare what will happen supi guna ha bhavati when this nit and not any nit it should be a sup pratya nit there can be many nit pratyas but if it is a sup uh, that nit pratya that pratya is a sup pratya and it is nit then and what ghi sanyasya Ang, the anga which has got gi sanya now not uh, the uh, uh, hari shabda here hiri hari shabda which has got gi sanya so gi sanyasya gniti supi gune guna bhavati so this gi ghir angasya ghir angasya gniti supi pare guna bhavati and how does he get this sup so 73111 if you look at 73111 this ghir gniti niti gosil 115 and what is the anuvrutti here gunaha gunaha from rasvasya gunaha you will get gunaha here so guna is the adesha and supi supi cha it is supi cha no 111 so this i need to check where is supi coming from here it says 103 let me cross check niti supi ya supi se so this is not uh, supi supi cha so this this is incorrect this is wrong so i'll uh, mark this as this is does not seem to be right it can't be 103 it has to go further so this seems to be wrong i'll uh, cross out this 103 and mark as something else let it be so this from supi cha there is an anuvrutti here ghir niti ghir niti supi gunah so we have our anupatti supi gunah gunah is the adesha supi pratyay pare saptami ek vachana and ghehe ghehe is sthani shashti ek vachana and niti niti supi pare the sup pratyay which is nit nyakara it yasmin supratye sa supratye nit pratya and niti tasmin niti pare ghe he angasya gunah bhavati thereby hari plus a what will happen hari plus ne will become hari plus a by lashakva tadhite lashaku atadhite it and then tasya lopah now this nit pratya is following so hari will take guna ikara's guna is ekara plus a now what will happen with sutra ekara followed by ekara
सो दिस इज बाय अवर सूत्र घेर घेर नीति सुपी गुण देन एचो यवायव एकार विल बी रिप्लेस बाय अय एच अय अयवायाव हरय प्लस ए एचो यवायाव देन हरय वर्णमेलन यूल गेट हरये सो हरये इज द चतुर्थी एक वचन हरिभ्या हरिभ्य सो भ्य सकार विल बिकम विसर्ग सोजुषो रोह एंड देन खरवसा नो विसर्जनीय सो हरि हरिभ्याम इज ऑलरेडी डन हरिभ्य विल बिकम हरिभ्य वर्णमेलन विसर्ग संधि नौ हरि प्लस न्यसी न्यसी इज वॉट हरि प्लस न्यसी हरि प्लस न्यसी इस षष्टी पंचमी एक वचन न्यसी इज पंचमी एक वचन वॉट हेपन्स हियर ही इंट्रोड्यूस इज अनदर सूत्र न्यसी ज्ञसोच वे न्यसी और न्यस दिस इज ड्यूअल न्यसी ज्ञसो हो न्यसी ज्ञसो हो न्यसी ज्ञसो हो चिक्स वन डबल वन झीरो सो सिक्स वन डबल वन झीरो वन वन झीरो वॉट इज ए सूत्र न्यसी ज्ञसो च किम भवति सो आई हैव क्रॉस आउट मार्क ओके सो न्यसी ज्ञसो अति अति सो अति ज्ञसी ज्ञसो नॉट दैट न्यसी और न्यस विच हेज टेकन सम आदेश दी अस अस मीन्स अथ दी अथ अथ प्लस सकारा अथ इज वॉट अथ मीन्स अकारा एंड सकारा सो अकारा शुड बी फॉलोइंग न्यसी अकारा शुड बी फॉलोइंग दिस अति गोसिल वन वन थ्री सो अति इज मे बी नीडेड एल्सवेर हियर इट मे नॉट बी यू सो यूजफुल बट इट इज देर इन अनुवृत्ति we can make use of it if it makes sense if there is a if it is going to get trouble uh, as in if ati is not there then something else will go wrong like as in nyasi nyasi gnyasoscha gets adesha what adesha you get at uh, tag nyasi gnyasa inatsyaha so in that case there may be an issue but in the case that is true only for adanta here we are not dealing with adanta therefore ati may not be useful here then why is it there it is there we don't care why it is there here unless we need it people have the tendency to ask ati why is it ati there without that also it may make sense why pandini maharshi did that we don't know but here in this case what we can say it goes at 113 it goes till 113 here if it is has no use after this it may have some use we know very little so he makes sense out of whatever we know in yatigya suscha ati if it does not i am not saying it does not find use if it does not find use here then it may find use later and in sutras the anuvrutti is carried sometimes it goes without touching the sutra it jumps so which is called as manduka pluti it jumps like a frog so it may jump 10 sutras ahead 15 sutras ahead and uh, that kind of an anuvrutti may not be there anywhere sometimes it may not apply to one sutra and it may apply to many other sutras therefore the anuvrutti is there it is not made use of we make use of anuvrttis only when it is needed that's the pandini prakriya anyway so gnyasigna suscha ati kim bhavati you see engaha engaha after eng gnyasigna suscha uh, engaha purva so purva and what is the prakriya here you see ek of purva parayo ek of purva parayo ho purva एकादेश एकादेश 
therefore when we are doing this derivation what will happen here the earlier sutra that we saw jhair niti nye is nyat pratya what about nyas nyasi and nyas they are also nyat pratya so guna will hold the guna that we did with the earlier sutras here ghair niti supi guna it is supratya the way nye is supratya niti uh, uh, and uh, sorry is nyat pratya and supratya similarly nyasi and nyas are also panchami ek vachana and shashti ek vachana are also like chaturthi ek vachana they are supratyas and they are nit pratyas therefore ghair niti we apply through and through fifth and sixth sutra see yeah, sir fifth and sixth ek vachana panchami shashti ek vachana so hari plus nyasi what will we get nyas will go ikara will nyasi is nyasi this is nyasi nyasi nyaso stage is also like this nyasi nyaso stage वॉट हैपन्स फर्स्ट गुण घेर नीति गुण वी हेव टू डू गुण एंग अनुवृत्ति जो मार्क अनुवृत्ति एंग एंग वॉट एल्स अति इज देर लेट इट बी अति एंड एक पूर्व परयो एंड वी ऑल्सो सो पूर्व आदेश पूर्व सो पूर्व एक पूर्व पूर्व परयो एक एक आदेश पूर्व परयो पूर्व एक आदेश लेट मी राइट इन सीक्वेन्स इट्स पूर्व परयो पूर्व एक आदेश सैथ एंग सो एंग इज वॉट एंग एंग अंत एंग अंत एंग अंत अंगा एंग अंगा अंगा सो दिस दिसफुल एज टू विच केस न्यसिग्नसो हो इफ यू मार्क इट सप्तमी देन पंचमी बलियान देर बाय समथिंग एल्स मे हेपन सो षष्टी द्विवचना न्यसिग्नसो हो च एंग अति पूर्व परयो बट हियर पूर्व परयो इज देर सो वी नीड नॉट वरी पूर्व परयो हो स्थाने बोथ दी अरियर एंड लेटर मीन्स वॉट द एंग एंड एंग हाउ विल यू गेट एंग फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल हाउ विल यू गेट एंग बाय गुण हरे प्लस अस सेम थिंग लशक वीते तस्य लोपा एंड ऑल्सो उपदेश जनुनासिक तस्य लोपा देर बाय अस एंड देन घेर नीति घेर नीति गुण सो यू गॉट गुण सो यू गॉट ए नाउ एंग एंग आफ्टर एंग एंग अंत एंग अंत हरे शब्द दट हरे वंस यू गेट हरे हरे इज एंग अंत देन वॉट हेपन्स अति इज देर बट सुप वेन दिस सुप प्रत्य फॉलोस देन यसीसो हो पूर्व परयो स्थाने वचन पूर्व एक आदेश सैथ यू विल गेट वन आदेश फॉर बोथ वॉट इज द आदेश पूर्व एंड पूर्व इज वॉट ए सो एकार एंड अकार अति एकार एंड अकार बोथ विल बी रिप्लेस बाय एकार सो यू विल गेट हरे हरे एंड सकार हरे यू विल गेट हरे बाय द करेंट सूत्र हरे वॉट हेपन्स टू सकार नाउ हरे रू इट बिकम हरे रू देन हरे हरेर दिस उपदेश जनुनासिक तस्य लोप हाउ डू गेट रू ससजुषो रू ससजुषो रू देन This by Upadeshe, everywhere it will apply. Upadeshe, Janunasika, Ach Anunasika, it then Tasselo Paha. The same sutras have applied earlier also. Here, they will have applied here also. And 
not only this, also the sutra for Nyakara to be taken away, which is the sutra we saw, Lashakvat Taddite. I'll just copy paste this. Lashakvat Taddite will also have applied. Lashakvat Taddite and both cases, both its letters will go by Tasya Lopaha. Then Gherniti, Gunaha, Hare, then Hare Ru, Hare, then Hare Refa, what will happen? Kharavasa Nayor, Nayor Visarjaniha. Avasana is there, therefore Visarjaniha, Visarjaniha, Visarga Adesha. Hare He, thereby you will get Hare He. And this will be in what? Panchami Ekvachana. Now Shashti Ekvachana also, same thing. How? Just Upadesha Janunasika, it will not apply, but Nyasi and Nyas or Nyas, same sequence of Shashti Ekvachana also, you will get the same. Only Upadeshi Janunasika it will not apply because Nyas does not have any uh, Ikara here, does not have any Anunasika it does not have. But otherwise everything else will be same. Lashakvattadite, Tasya Lopa, Gherniti, Gnasi Gnasusya, Tasushuru, Upadeshi Janunasika it, Tasya Lopa and Kharavasani or Visarjani, all these will be same. So the form is Hare He in Panchami Ekvachan and Shashti Ekvachan. Therefore I think that's the reason he has written two here. I don't know whether it is there in all books, but two is there here. So, eng, so I didn't read the vritti. Vritti engaha nyasigna soho ati purva rupam ekadesha. Purva rupam ekadesha. This is what we got from the uh, sutra patha anurutti zanive. Did I read the earlier vritti here? Yeah. Supi gunaha. Okay. Then what hariyoho harinam? How do you get hariyoho? Hari? Plus Hari plus Os. Hari plus Os, what will happen? What is Ikara Okara Sandhi? Yana Sandhi? What is the Sutra for Yana Sandhi? Yes, anyone? What is the sutra for Yana Sandhi? Yeah, Iko Yanachi. So Iko Yanachi, what is the Adesha? Ikara and Okara, what will be the Adesha in Yana Sandhi? Ikaha, Yana Adesha Sat. E U real real will be replaced by Yavarala. So here Ikara by Ya. So Hari. Hari plus Os. What will happen then? Haryor Ru. Same sutra that we saw earlier. Haryoru. Haryor. Then Haryoho. Again twice. Shashti Divachana, Saptami Divachana, same form. Harinam. Harinam, what will happen? So this O says what? Shashti Divachana, Saptami Divachana. Not mark the sutras because they are just there. One one uh, example back. That's all. So Hari plus Am Shasti Bahuvachana. So you have to do all the sutras now, if we can recall. You have to get. So I just mentioned Numa Desha Hari Hari Numa Desha. So what will happen here? Num first Numa Desha should come. Then. Vidochantyat Paraha. So Numadesha will come by one of this sutra. Which sutra? Raswa Nadhyapo Nut. Raswa. So this is Raswa. So Raswa. Raswa Nadhyapo Nut. Not Numadesha. Nudadesha. Nut Agama. Not even Adesha. I am sorry. So too many mistakes today. I am sorry. Uh, so Nudagama. Let me just confirm the sutra. And then Dirgha also. You will get Dirgha Nami. So Nami Dirgha and then uh, since I am not too well today, let me cross check and avoid more mistakes. So um, yeah, let me see this picture. Um, yeah, Harsunadhyapo note and then 
Nami, yeah, Nami. So, so far, so good. Okay. So, you, here you will get root. Nuragama. Hari plus arm um, will become Hari plus Hari plus Nam. How? By Raswa Nadiapo Nut. We get Nut. Nut contains Takara is it by Halanti Mit, the Silopa, Ukara by Upadeshi Janunasikait. Content is Nakara. Where should this Nakara go? Adhyanta Takitu. Adhyanta to takitav thereby being tit adi it will go adi so adi of what it is for the arm pratyaya will take root therefore adi of arm will take nakara root and it will become nam hari hari nam then hari this will become hari by what by Nami Dirga, when Nam, Nam follows Nami Dirga. Dirga Deshasya, thereby Hari Ikara will become Ikara. Now Hari Nam Nakara, what will happen? Same sutra that we saw, Natvam Hari Nam Atkupvangnu Yavayepi. What we saw here, this copy paste. Katkupvangu Yavayepi Rashabhyam Nunaha Samanapade. Thereby Rupa Siddhya Shashti Bhuvachana. What else is there? As an example, Harinam. Yeah, we are done. So, this sutra is done. Next, Saptami Ekvachana. Saptami Ekvachana, what happens? Hari. Hari plus. Ni, Ni Pratya, Saptami, Ekvachana. Nit Pratya, but here, what does he say? Achya Ghehe. Achya Ghe, in some sutra pathas, this will be a single sutra. This and the earlier sutra. Earlier sutra is 7, 3, triple 1, somewhere here, 7, 3, triple 1, let's see, okay. Achya ghehe, there is out achya ghe. Here it says out. This out is which is there, that is an anuvritti in this sutra. Otherwise, out or one single sutra achya ghe. What does our sutra pata have? 73119. Uh, okay. okay. 73119. 119 says Achya Ghe We just saw Ango Nastriyam And here Out Idudbhyam Out So all these are in sequence Idudbhyam Out Achya Ghe But Out and Achya Ghe some, In some Sutra Patas They are combined in as Aud Achya Ghe Sutra is Aud Achya Ghe So some versions of Kashika will have this Aud Achya Ghe and if it is a single sutra, then there are, there are two adeshas. Out is Prathama Ekvachana, At Chaghehe, Ghe is Shashti Ekvachana, Chakara is an obvious, but here A, At, this At, At is, a, is also Prathama Ekvachana. So if you have a single sutra, Out At Chaghehe, Out and At both are in Samanadi Karanam Ekvachana, but you also have Ghehe, it is not a Sanya sutra. When you have Ghehe in Shashti Ekvachana, it is an Adesha Sutra. It is a Vidhi Sutra. And the Vidhi in Audacha Ghe there will be two Adeshas. Out is one Adesha and Ach is another Adesha. If these are single Sutras then Ach is the Adesha for Ghi. For Ghi At is the Adesha and Out is what? Idudbhyam Out. So you look at the Vritti you will see it better. So Out Idudbhyam. We will just mark the Anuvritti. Anuvritti here is uh, this all these Achya Ghe in 119 you will have Nyehe but here what are we interested in this is Idudbhyam Out Idudbhyam Out Out 
इदुद्भ्याम औत व्हाट इज इदुद्भ्याम इदुद्भ्याम इज पंचमी द्विवचन औत इज एन आदेश एंड अच्छघे इन दैट दिस दिस फॉन्ट इज नॉट राइट यू सी अच्छर इट इज नॉट अच्छर अच्छघे सो अच्छे इज अत अत च ये अत इज तपर कर्णम हैज बीन डन तपर तत्काल से सो अकार ओनली अकार अत च सो चकार दिस आल्सो फॉर घी दिस इज आल्सो एन आदेश सो औत इज एन आदेश ऑल राइट बट अत इज आल्सो एन आदेश फॉर व्हाट घे है इदुद्भ्याम इदुद्भ्याम उत्तरस्य ने है सो ऑफ कोर्स ने है इज आल्सो देयर दिस ने है दैट वी सॉ ने है दिस ने है हियर सो ने है ने है दिस इज आल्सो षष्टी एक वचन है देयर आर टू आदेशस इदुद्भ्याम उत्तरस्य ने है औत आदेश स्यात इफ इट इज अ सिंगल सूत्र इफ देयर आर टू डिफरेंट सूत्रस औत एंड अच्छे हे है This nehe goes till one one nine, but here idudhyam out. Idudhyam out will tell you idudhyam uttarasya nehe out adesha syaat. So a single adesha. Achcha ghee separate sutra will say ghee ghee will take ad adesha. So the anga will take ad adesha. Pratyaya ni prat ni ni nehe is uh, uh, this ni pratyaya. सब विच इज अ सप्तमी एक वचन प्रत्यय सो सप्तमी एक वचन वचन प्रत्यय विल टेक औत आदेश एंड घी द अंगा विल टेक अत आदेश दीज आर टू आदेश सेपरेटली इन सेपरेट सूत्र टू सेपरेट सूत्र और इन अ सिंगल सूत्र ऑल्सो देर आर टू आदेश बट दो बोथ आदेश आर ऑब्वियसली नॉट फॉर द सेम स्थान औत आदेश इज फॉर प्रत्यय घी एंड अत आदेश इज फॉर घी देर फोर दिस हरी इज घी नी इज नीज नी ने है अवतादेश एंड हरी घी हरी घी हरे हरी घी ही विल टेक विच आदेश इट विल टेक अत आदेश देर बाय एंड घे है अच्छ ही सेज घे अच्छ भवती सो ही हेज ऑलरेडी टेक इन दी अनुवृत्ति और यू कैन कंसिडर आर जस्ट मार्केट इन ब्रैकेट अ सिंगल सूत्र कैन बी वॉट औदच्च घे है That can also be a sutra, so I'll just mark in bracket. This is optionally this sutra. Number is irrelevant because numbers will change when the sutras are split or they are collapsed. Then there is yoga vibhaga also; they'll be separate. Idu bhya uttarasya gne he auta desha sya gne he cha ata desha sya. This is how this vritti should read. So two adeshas are given. Otherwise, in fact, he has considered it as uh, single vritti. even if you take it as this uh, single sutra still being these having anuruttis you don't have to apply the earlier sutra out in the same sutra the all these padas are there all these padas from the earlier two three sutras uh, they are there therefore in the single sutra he can get two adesha although the sutras themselves are not combined idudbhyam uttarasya gnehe auta adesha sya ghe cha achades Sasyat. So thereby, you will apply. Hari will become, will take out adesha. Out adesha. Thereby, what is the adesha? It will become out. Uh, out adesha. Tapara karan. There also tapara karan has been done. Out is a single letter. That is the adesha. Single letter will replace single letter. Therefore, alone tasya will bring in. Ikara will be replaced by out ikara. So we will get haro. You should get haro. and uh, not haro sorry uh, har hari plus au ni will take e will take au au adesh so e will be replaced by au what about ghe acha at is the adesh at is a single letter akara again takara takara is tapara karanam so at is akara is the adesh takara will go what you will have is hari ikara the alone ke alone just here so ikara will be replaced by akara so you will get hara plus au if you get hari plus au what will be the uh, form hari plus au you will get haryau right you will get yana sandhi but here you don't get yana sandhi what is the form harau how do you get harau akara and aukara ikara and aukara sandhi will be different 
and thereby the form will change. Therefore, two adeshas at one go, hara plus au, not hari plus au. So you will get hara plus au. That's why this hari uh, here, although this is nit, it does not take this, uh, does not take guna. The earlier guna which other nit pratyas uh, when they follow niti, ghir niti. Here you saw ghir niti. In Nyasigna Soscha as well as Gher Niti. Uh, we saw Gher Niti, Gunaha and Nyasigna Soscha means in Nyasi, when Nyasi Pratya follows and Nyas Pratya follows, that time we saw Guna. What about Ni? Nyakara is it in Ni also. However, in the Saptami Ekvachana Sthana, you have this Sutra which will apply. Thereby it will take away the uh, Akara, uh, it will take away the Ikara itself and you can't cause Guna because Akara is the Adesha and thereby hara plus au. Hara plus au, I'll, I'll write both here. Au dacha ghehe. Au dacha ghehe. By that sutra, hara plus au. And then, hara plus au, what will be the sandhi now? Vridhirechi. So, Vridhir, when H follows, Vridhirechi. Thereby, Harau is the form. Okay, so. What, what remains now? So, uh, Harau, Harishu. Harayohi is already done. Harishu, what will happen? Harishu. So, Harishu is Hari plus Su. Saptami. Bahuvachana. Not much to do. Just add them together, you will get Harishu. And what happens to the Sakara? Here the Sutra the Chai added earlier mistakenly Harishu. So here Shatvam. By what? This is the Sakara is not an Adesha Sakara, but it is a Pratyaya Sakara. So Adesha Adesha Pratya Yayoho Pratya Pratyaya Yoho Adesha or Pratyaya Sakara Adesha Pratyaya Sakarasya which is what Apadantasya This Sakara is not a Padanta Sakara because Ukara is following therefore Apadantasya Sakarasya Apadantasya Sakarasya Murdhanya Adesha Syat Murdhanya Adesha Syat When? Is it all the time? No in Koho, when in Pratyahara letter precedes or Ku, Kavarga letter precedes. Therefore, in Koho, in Koho only, only when in. And here, Kavarga letter is not preceding, Ikara is preceding, which is in. So, that is the Adesha here. Sakara becomes Murdhanya and you get Harishu. Now, uh, he moves on to Saki Shabda. For Saki Shabda, he needs a sutra Anang Sau. Anang Sau. What is Anang? Anang is Prathama Ekvachana. What is Sau? Sau is Saptami Ekvachana of Su, like Gurau. Gurau, Saptami Ekvachana, you will get Su, Saptami Ekvachana, you will get Sau. When Sau follows, Sau follows, when Su Pratya follows. What is the Anurti 7193? 7193? Anang Sau. Anang Sau. Asam Buddhau. Sakyuhu. Sakyuhu, see, uh, to make sense of Sakyu, you should also already know how Sakhi Shabda declines. So, we know how Saki declines, we want to know why so. So, the sutras tell you why so. 
सो नो हियर सखी शब्द सख्यु हु सख्यु सखी शब्द से सो इन सख्यु इज सखी सखी शब्द असंबुद्धो व्हेन यू आर डिराइविंग सखी शब्द इन असंबुद्धि असंबुद्धि मींस व्हाट नॉट संबुद्धि व्हाट इज नॉट संबुद्धि संबुद्धि इज प्रथमा संबोधनम प्रथमा एक वचन इज संबुद्धि सो नॉट इन संबुद्धि बट इज इट इन ऑल केसेस लुक एट द वृत्ति ही सेस सख्यु अंगस्य अनंग आदेशः स्यात् असंबुद्धौ सौ ओनली व्हेन सु सु फॉलोस सो हियर टेक द अनुर्ति ऑफ सख्यु सख्यु असंबुद्धौ अंगस्य सो सख्यु अंगस्य असंबुद्धौ not in sambuddhi and these are uh, sakyuhu angasya just a second so sakhi shabda is a little tricky derivation is of course whatever declines in such a manner so many sutras are there so you have to be careful uh, declension is difficult sakhi shabda सो सख्यु अंगस्य अनंग आदेश स्यात् असंबुद्धौ सौ सो व्हेन सो फर्स्ट प्रत्यय यू ऐड सखी प्लस सु सु औ जस सु सु यू एडेड सु विल बिकम सकारा बट सु व्हेन सु सौ सौ मींस सु फॉलोस दैट टाइम सखी विल टेक व्हाट सखी विल टेक अनंग आदेश अंग Now anang is how many letters here? Akara, nakara. Let's say nyakara goes by nit, but akara, nakara, akara. A na, a na, a na, a. So a na, akara, nakara, akara. Three letters. What happens if you make an adesha for multi multi letter adesha? Will it alone just say apply? Or anekal sit sarvasya. So by anekal sit sarvasya. What should the adesh apply to? Should the adesh apply to a single letter, last letter, or the entire word? If you apply anang adesh to sakhi, anang is a multi-letter adesh. Where should the multi-letter? I mean, which stani? Which is the stani when multi-letter adesh is there? Stani is the entire shabda. So if you replace sakhi with anang. what will happen you will get anang plus su but nichya alontyasya nichya nyakara is it here although it is multi letter adesha still if it is a nit adesha still it will apply to antya al so sakhi ikara will take anang adesha anang nyakara is it what is the content ana so sakhi ikara will go away and you will add ana what will you get sakhana so sakhana uh, is it anang or is it anang i think it will be akara will also have to be yeah it is anang so you see the swara is gone ajanu nasika this is all anang so this this adesh is anang so content is not ana content is an anang sorry so many errors so anang anang so so anang is the adesha when anang is the adesha here also say anang when anang is the akara will go nyakara will go by halantya mit this akara will go by upadesha janunasika tasya lopa so an is the adesha so you will get sakhan sakhan will be the adesha does not matter whether it is akara is it but is nyakara it even if you take akara it still it is two letters two letters is multi letters therefore a uh, uh, why did he add ag nyakara because he did not want the multi letter an un, un to replace sakhi completely otherwise uh, the paribhasha sutra which is uh, anekal shit anekal an, un would become anekal akara and nakara is anekal 
therefore anekal will replace the entire sakhi shabda but he wants the adesha only for ikara otherwise sakhi cannot become anang you can't decline anang so sakhi will become sakhan sakhan plus sung sakhan plus sakara sakhan plus sakara here now what happens here nakara is there now he says i still need more sutra it does i can't make sakhan plus sa and make sense out of it so he needs another few sutras before he declines the prathama ekvachana so many sutras only for prathama ekvachana for sakhi shabda he needs alone tyat puro upada this is a definition sanya sutra alone tyat puro upada i have explained what is upada penultimate letter second last letter that's all upada is but the sutra is what alone tyat puro upada how do you say second last letter and second last letter means what here it is antyat purva ala antyat ala purva antyat ala purva ala is panchami al panchami of al is will be ala and antya antya will decline in panchami as antyat ramavat so antyat ala purva ya bhavati sah upadha sanyam bhavati so antyat ala purva varna upada sanya syat thereby you will get alaha which is at the end the last letter antyat purva antyat purva upada so you see here upada is sanya upada sanya you don't need anything else so i'll just remove this no anurutti here antyad alah purva varna upada sanya syat so here in sakhan what is the upada what is the upada letter in sakhan this is the context where he has introduced so we should be able to identify at least upada for sakhan what is the upada letter in sakhan i'll wait for nansal to move on in sakhan what is the upada yeah so sakhan akara is the upada so sa sakara sa kh a sa kh a na so you see sa kh a na in that this akara this akara here after khakara is upada and what what why does he need upada sangya for akara here which is following khakara and before nakara that akara because there is another akara after sakara not this akara the second last is akara and nakara here this this akara just before nakara sakhan nakara akara akara which is preceding nakara of sakhan that gets upada sanya then what happens sarva nama sthane cha asambuddhau we have seen upada before but sarva nama sthane cha asambuddhau we are declining sakhi shabda sakhi shabda is pullinga we are in still in pullinga in pullinga ikaranta ajanta ajanta pullinga and in pullinga what is sarva nama sthana sudara punchakasya and sambuddhi we have seen sambuddhi is prathama ekvachana and asambuddha will be what which is not ekvachana prathama ekvachana therefore first five pratyas they they are sarva nama sthana but you leave the sambuddhi aside so what you is left is this four and in those four sthana sarva nama sthane cha asambuddha sarva nama sthane cha asambuddha when sambuddhi does not follow in that kind of a sarva nama sthana what happens 648 648 definitely there has to be upada because upada he has just defined for it upada yaha dirgah you will see upada 648 648 tells you what this no upada yaha na upada yaha goes till here sarva nama sthane cha asambuddhau here you see angasya and if you look up i don't want to scroll let's scroll up 
ಧನೋಪೆ ಪೂರ್ವಸ್ಯ ದೀರ್ಘೋಣ ಐ ಥಿಂಕ್ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ಇಯರ್ ಧನೋಪಸ್ಯ ಧನೋಪೆ ಪೂರ್ವಸ್ಯ ದೀರ್ಘೋಣ ವಿ ಹವ್ ಸೀನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ದಿಸ್ ದೀರ್ಘ ಪೂರ್ವಸ್ಯ ಧನೋಪೆ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಇರೆಲೆವೆಂಟ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ದೀರ್ಘ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಏಟೀನ್ ಆಲ್ ಇಸ್ ಗೋ ರಿಮೇನ್ ಇನ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಬಟ್ ಅಣಹ ದೀರ್ಘ ಗೋಸ್ಟಿಲ್ ಅಣಹ ಗೋಸ್ಟಿಲ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಟು ವಿ ಆರ್ ಬಿಯಾಂಡ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಟು ವಿ ಆರ್ ಆಟ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಏಟ್ ಸೊ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ಏಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಅನುವೃತ್ತಿ ಆಫ್ ದೀರ್ಘ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ದೀರ್ಘ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಧನೋಪೆ ಪೂರ್ವಸ್ಯ ದೀರ್ಘೋಣ ಅಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ದೀರ್ಘ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಆದೇಶ ಹಿಯರ್ ಸರ್ವನಾಮ ಸ್ಥಾನೇ ಚ ಅಸಂಬುದ್ಧ ಅಂಡ್ ಸರ್ವನಾಮ ಸ್ಥಾನೇ ಚ ಅಸಂಬುದ್ಧ ನ ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ನ ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ದೀರ್ಘ ಅಂಡ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಟ್ ನ ಉಪಧಾಯ ನ ಉಪಧಾಯ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸ್ಪ್ಲಿಟ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ನ ದಿಸ್ ಗಿವ್ಸ್ ಅ ರಾಂಗ್ ಇಂಪ್ರೆಷನ್ ನ ನ ದೀರ್ಘ ಬಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ದಟ್ ನ ಉಪಧಾಯ ದೀರ್ಘ ಸೊ ನ ಉಪಧಾಯ ದೀರ್ಘ ದೀರ್ಘ ಸೊ ಐ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಕೀಪ್ ಇಟ್ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ನ ಉಪಧಾಯ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಯು ಡೋಂಟ್ ಮೇಕ್ ದಿ ಮಿಸ್ಟೇಕ್ ಆಫ್ ನ ಸೊ ನ ಉಪಾಯ ಉಪಾಯ ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ದೀರ್ಘ ಅಂಡ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಸೊ ಲೆಟ್ ಮಿ ಮಾರ್ ದಿ ಅದರ್ವೈಸ್ ಯು ಸ್ಪ್ಲಿಟೆಡ್ ಯು ಡು ಮಾರ್ ದಿ ಕೇಸಸ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ವಿಲ್ ಫಿನಿಶ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸ್ಟಾಪ್ ಸೊ ಸರ್ವನಾಮ ಸ್ಥಾನೇ ಚ ಅಸಂಬುದ್ಧ ನ ಉಪಾಯ ನ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಸ್ಪ್ಲಿಟೆಡ್ then what should happen is that this na na upadhaya this na should be taken as shashti ek vachana not as na as in uh, an avyaya so uh, na upadhaya ha no upadhaya ha even in no upadhaya i'll just read you the vritti for no upadhaya ha from kashika uh, no upadhaya nantasya so no upadhaya ha there is na is not uh, negation ನಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ನೋಪಾಯ ನಂತಸ್ಯ ನಕಾರಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ಆರ್ ಇವನ್ ಇನ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಲುಕ್ ಆಟ್ ಲಘುವೃತ್ತಿ ವಾಟ್ ಯು ಸಿ ಲಘುವೃತ್ತಿ ಹಿಯರ್ ಲೆಟ್ ಮೀ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಚಿಕ್ ದಿ ಲಘುವೃತ್ತಿ ನೋಪಾಯ ಓಕೆ ಲಘು ನಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಉಪಾಯ ದೀರ್ಘ ನಾಮಿ ಸೊ ದೇರ್ ಅಸ್ ಅ ನಾಮಿ ಅನುವೃತ್ತಿ ದೇರ್ ಲೆಟ್ಸ್ ಲೀವ್ ದಟ್ ಬಟ್ ನಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಉಪಾಯ ನೋ ಉಪಾಯ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ನ ನ ದೀರ್ಘ ಯು ಶುಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಮೇಕ್ ನ ದೀರ್ಘ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದೀರ್ಘ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಆದೇಶ ದೀರ್ಘ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ನಿಗೇಟೆಡ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೆಡ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಸೊ ನ ನ ಇಸ್ ಷಷ್ಟಿ ಏಕ ವಚನ ಹಿಯರ್ ಉಪಾಯ ಉಪಾಯ and this this na and angasya will go together and form a tadanta vidhi na here nantasya this na the uh, supratya is not there so the supratya is gone here but it is na why because he has made uh, kind of a sama no padhaya he has made no padhaya and that no padhaya na, na here ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ಇಟ್ ಇಲ್ ಗೋ ವಿತ್ ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ಅಂಡ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ನಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಸೊ ದಟ್ಸ್ ಹೌ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ನಾಂತಸ್ಯ ನಕಾರಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಉಪಾಯ ಉಪಾಯ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ದಿಸ್ ಉಪಧ ನಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಉಪಾಯ ದಿ ಉಪಧ ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಷಷ್ಠಿ ಏಕ ವಚನ ಹೌ ಇಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಷಷ್ಠಿ ಯು ಸಿ ನೋ ಉಪಾಯ ಇಫ್ ಯು ರೀಡ್ ದಮ್ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಮೇಕ್ ಸಮ್ ಸೆನ್ಸ್ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಟ್ ಅದರ್ವೈಸ್ ನ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಟೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಅಸ್ ಅನ್ ಅವ್ಯಯ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ನಿಗೇಶನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅ ನಿಗೇಶನ್ ನಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಸೊ ಅಲ್ ಪುಟ್ ಅ ಡ್ಯಾಶ್ ಇಯರ್ ಪುಟ್ ಅ ಡ್ಯಾಶ್ ಇಯರ್ ಎಸ್ ಲುಪ್ತ ಷಷ್ಟಿ ನಿರ್ದೇಶ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಟೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಲುಪ್ತ ಷಷ್ಟಿ ನಿರ್ದೇಶ ಅಂಡ್ ದೇರ್ ಬೈ ನಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ನ ಅಂಡ್ ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ಗೋ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಫಾರ್ಮಿಂಗ್ ತದಂತ ವಿಧಿ ನಾಂತಸ್ಯ ಅಂಗಸ್ಯ ಉಪಾಯ ದೀರ್ಘ ಭವತಿ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅ ಸ್ಥಾನಿ ವೈ ಇಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅ ಸ್ಥಾನಿ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಉಪಾಯ ಇಸ್ ಸಿಟಿಂಗ್ ದ
सो नान्तस्य उपदाया उपदा ऑफ सो दिस षष्टी इज नॉट अ स्थाने षष्टी अंगस्य दिस षष्टी न एंड अंगस्य आर इन सामनाधिकरण्यम उपदाया इज स्थाने षष्टी वेर एज दिस न दिस इज जस्ट संबंध षष्टी न एंड अंगस्य आर संबंध षष्टी देर बाय देवी का नान्त नान्तस्य अंगस्य नाउ नान्तस्य अंगस्य उपदा व्हिच इज द उपदा ऑफ दैट सो उपदा दिस उपधाया कनेक्ट्स विथ अंगस्य अंगस्य और अदर अंगस्य नान्तस्य अंगस्य कनेक्ट्स विथ उपधाया दे आर नॉट इन सामनाधिकरण्य जस्ट बिकॉज दे आर हैविंग द सेम केस देयरफॉर दिस इज अ संबंध षष्टी न एंड अंगस्य दे विल बिकम नान्तस्य अंगस्य एंड उपधाया इज द स्थानी स्थाने षष्टी उपधाया दीर्घ होती न तो अंगस्य दीर्घ अंगस्य दीर्घ देन अलोन्त्य स्टील कमिंग बट उपदाया दीर्घ उपदाया एंड अंगस्य अलोन्त्य के नॉट बी इन सामनाधिकरण्य वन इज द लास्ट लेटर अनदर इज दी सेकेंड लास्ट लेटर सेकेंड लास्ट लेटर एंड रियल लेटर के नॉट बी सेम इवन इफ दे आर उच्चारण दे आर सेम बट स्टील दे आर डिफरेंट लेटर्स सो बोथ के नॉट बी दी स्थानी स्थानी इज ओनली उपदा अंगस्य षष्टी इज संबंध षष्टी एंड अंगस्य उपदाया लाइक दशरथ से पुत्र दशरथ से पुत्र से इफ यू से दशरथ से एंड पुत्र से अरे सामान अधिकरण है बट पुत्र इज राम और लक्ष्मण बट दशरथ इज नॉट पुत्र सो दशरथ से पुत्र से दशरथ से पुत्र से विवाह और दैट मे नॉट साउंड गुड सो दशरथ से पुत्र से वनगमनम सो ही गोज टू वना सो दशरथ इज नॉट गोइंग पुत्र इज गोइंग राम इज गोइंग सो just because they are in same case this is a good example to see that just because people think that samanadikaranam is same uh, vibhakti and vachana that is not samanadikaranam samanadikaranam has a different definition here you see upadayah and angasya although they are shashti naha is also shashti still they are not in samanadikaranam so dasharatasya the way it is sambandha shashti but uh, पुत्र से इज नॉट संबंध षष्टी दे आर नॉट इन सामनाधिक उपदाया अंगस्य दीर्घ होती उपदाया दीर्घ होती न तो अंगस्य सो नान्तस्य उपदाया दीर्घ असंबुद्ध सर्वनाम स्थान इन सर्वनाम स्थान सुडनपुंसक यू विल गेट दि अदर आदेश एंड देर बाय वॉट विल हेपन हियर उपदा यू विल जस्ट उपदाया दीर्घ होती आल जस्ट स्टॉप हियर बाय डिराइविंग सखान विल डू दि रेस्ट because there are more sutras we will not have landed uh, sak sakhan sakhan plus we had derived till sakhan sakhan plus su the sakara which has become sakara sakans i'll make it sakans sakans what happens with this sakans is what will happen this with the seconds is sorry let's keep it separate sakan plus sa will become sakhan plus sa dirgha for akara is what is akara so sakhan plus sa i'll just mention now this uh, halanta halniya abhyo sutisi apruktam hal this aprukta this will be aprukta he'll define what is aprukta then he'll introduce a sutra which will use the aprukta sanya which is halniya abhyo this ekal pratyaya single pratyaya ekal pratyaya will be called as aprukta and aprukta sanya he will introduce then he will say that halanta halan halniya abhyo halanta niyanta abanta when they have hal this following suti si su ti and su suti si si ti and si are usually in tinganta tiptas and sip tip and sip and su suti si su is usually in subanta so this su means sakara of su will undergo lopa lupyate so he will take away this sakara so he will be left with sakan then he will say this nakara at the end of this pada because this sakan plus su is a pada when sakara goes away pratye lope pratye lakshanam although this sakara goes away sakan will still be a pada and therefore this sakan will retain the pada sanya and also pratipadika is nakara this is pratipadika which has taken a little change so nakara at the end of the pratipadika which is at the end of the pada will undergo lopa 
therefore nalop of pratipati kante see he'll talk about and then he'll land on sakha so many sutras to make sakhi sakha so sakhi shabda will decline in prathama ekvachana sakha and it will get more complicated as we go we'll see uh, understand the sutras for what they are don't try to remember sutras in the context of sakhi shabda because these sutras are one off it will not be useful so much useful i'm doing it for completion and to show you how detail oriented these are okay sorry i have taken more time i'll stop here उत्तावसाने नटराज राजो नन्ना दशकान नव पंचवारम उधर तो कामसन का दिशिधाने तर विमर्शे सुसूत्र जालम एनी क्वेश्चंस नो क्वेश्चंस एनीवन एल्स Any questions regarding the homework yesterday? See, the homework was optional, but those who tried it, please try it seriously. If you try it, uh, cross-check before you send something to me. Don't do padacheda when there is no padacheda, and take the hint seriously. Without that hint, it is very unlikely that you will land on it. The hints have come because I find something I find difficult. if i resolve it i see or if i see something resolved then if i give that as an exercise i'll see that hint is helpful so without if you don't use the hint if you don't if you can't make sense of the hint then please don't solve it if it is optional because without the hint if you have not got the hint then just don't do blindly you will not get it most likely you will not i'm not saying to dishearten anyone this is as far as our knowledge goes this is only to show us our limitations and show us how much study is needed to get even a simple anvaya right padacheda right so much can be there so we have to see whatever appears straight forward and does not make sense we will have missed something so this exercise will tell you that how easy it is to miss one entire pada entire pada you can miss even if you know sandhis because some sandhis are hidden with or without the sandhis the padas are same they can be seen so that is to show you 